All right, we're gonna make uh, part number four, which is the table pin for the Arbor Press project. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and click part to start a new part. Uh, if we take a look at the print, this is the part that we're gonna make. Looks like it's one extrusion, that's a circle. Uh, this is what we call limiting dimension, so it's the maximum and minimum the pin can be. Um, you can go ahead and just, uh, a lot of times if it's a sliding part, I'll just create the part um, at the bottom number. It doesn't necessarily matter. Um, it should all work out. So we'll create a circle, we, we'll extrude it, and then we'll put a chamfer on the end of it. All right, so here we go. We'll start a 2D sketch on the front plane. We'll come over to circle, start on the origin, drag that thing out to 0.252. Again, I'm looking at the blueprint. We're going to finish that sketch. We're going to extrude it. The pin looks to be one inch long, so we'll hit one, hit OK. And now we'll put the chamfer on it, which is here. Uh, we'll come over and that's the front of that pin right there. It looks like this chamfer is coming in 0 .06 is what it's supposed to. It defaults, Inventor defaults to 45 degrees automatically, so uh, we don't have to make any other changes then to accept that. Um, that's it for that part. The only other thing you have to do now is um, kind of bring this thing over and I was check to see what the material is made out of. So the table pin is actually made out of aluminum 6061. So we're going to bring that back over. You'll go to your inventor I. Come down to I properties. Physical tab. Always defaults to generic and we'll just scroll up a little bit to find aluminum 6061. You can see it's a very, very small part, not anything for weight, you know, far, far smaller than a pound. Uh, hit apply, hit close, and now you uh, applied your um, weight to that bad boy, and you're good to go. So we'll go ahead and save that. And again, it uh, should come into your Arbor Press project right here. I always kind of like to name it uh, the part that I'm working on. So this is part number four. It's called the table pin. And I put my last name at the end of it, just uh, makes files easier to find later on. Uh, and then go ahead and save that. And that's it.